at the first case i am going to have a square matrix of order 2 cross 2 and after that we need to find at the last case we need to find out the eigenvalues of that square matrix let's assume i am having a square matrix of order 2 cross 2 which is having elements such as a1 and a1 and to find the eigenvalues we have to use a characteristic equation So the characteristics equation is given as determinant of a minus this lambda i which is equal to this 0 and this uh, we know that it is given and this eigenvalue multiplying with this identity matrix it can be written as eigenvalue multiplying and this identity matrix is having the same order as that of this square matrix that is 2 cross 2 so we have we are having this identity matrix as this thing and this minus of this eigenvalue is going to multiply with the each of its element then this is going to be equals to this minus times the eigenvalue 0 0 and minus times this eigenvalue and it's so this is the matrix so at first case we need to do some addition between this uh, square matrix and this matrix and after that we need to find out its determinant and because of that let us have right here a square matrix such as a1 a1 elements and this is subtracted with this right here we are going to have a positive sign which is going to add with this eigenvalues and this is and its resultant value we are going to find out its determinant and this is equals to this value 0 after that let us add these elements corresponding elements such as then it becomes this a minus this eigenvalue and this becomes 1 and a plus 0 is this a and 1 minus of this eigenvalue we are having 1 minus this eigenvalue and its determinant equals to 0 and now let us find out its determinant then it becomes a minus this eigenvalue multiplying with this 1 minus the eigenvalue minus times right here we need to have the product of a into this 1 so a into 1 equals to 0 now we are having we need to multiply these elements and when you when you multiply a with this one we are having a value as a and when this a multiplying with this minus of this eigenvalue we will have minus of this eigenvalue which is equal to this a times this eigenvalue and this minus of this eigenvalue is multiplying with this 1 at that case we are having this minus times the eigenvalue and when you multiply these eigenvalues both of them are having the same sign this becomes a plus before that let us write the product of these two eigenvalues and if you do this we are having a positive value for, and then we have this eigenvalue square so this becomes let us add all these terms that is eigenvalue square minus this eigenvalue and this minus this a times this eigenvalue minus of this a equals to zero and this is also equals to let's take this eigenvalue as common in that case we have one plus this a minus of this a equals to zero and you can also take this a as a common then we will have this square minus i think right here somewhere it has gone wrong let us make this determinant find out its determinant again we are having a minus this eigenvalue multiplying with this 1 minus 
this eigenvalue minus of this a equals to 0 then we have a minus this a times this eigenvalue minus this eigenvalue plus this eigenvalue square minus a equals to 0 then we have eigenvalue square minus of this eigenvalue multiplying with this a plus 1 equals to 0 in that case the eigenvalues are 0 and another eigenvalue is a plus 1 so we have these two eigenvalues and roots of this characteristic equation is the of this matrix is actually the eigenvalues so roots of this characteristics equation of a matrix gives the eigen value so this is the one method and the next method is that is suppose we have certain options and we need to find uh, from, those, from those options like what is the trace of a matrix A and when it comes to the trace of a matrix A this is going to be equals to the sum of the leading diagonal elements and right here you can observe that we have the leading diagonal element as this A and this one so this is the leading diagonal elements and because these are present inside present inside this leading diagonal element so trace of this square matrix is nothing but the sum of leading diagonal elements and when you are finding out the trace of a matrix this will be equals to the sum of the eigenvalues so for 2 cross 2 matrix we are having the eigenvalue as this eigenvalue and eigenvalue 2 so this becomes eigenvalue 1 plus this eigenvalue 2 equals to this a plus 1 and from the options you can find out if any of the two eigenvalues and its sum is equals to this a plus 1 then we say that uh, that is the correct option.